briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In a 1881 case, Gen V. Rich, heard by the United States District Court for the District of Massachusetts, a potentially arbitrary exception diverging from the general societal comprehension took the stage. At the heart of it lay the question, does one establish firm ownership of a resource, previously unclaimed, when they have done everything possible to assert their property right? Here's how the unusual dispute unfolded. A fisherman, the plaintiff, had shot a finback whale in the Arctic seas using a bomb lance etched with his identification. It was a local custom that once a dead whale resurfaced, the finder would alert the original fisherman and receive a finder's fee. However, the quirk in this case arose when the finder chose to sell the whale to the defendant, Rich, instead of returning it to the plaintiff, Gen. Gen took legal action, arguing he rightfully owned the dead whale as his actions of hunting it down and killing it asserted his possession. The majority's intricate opinion, penned down by Justice Nelson, detailed the method of whaling in Provincetown. The daring fishermen embarked on these risky missions to pursue finback whales, attacking them with bomb lances. The slain whales would sink to the seabed, only to resurface after a few days. Many would wind up being discovered by nearby vessels or wash ashore, leading the discoverers to notify the hunter who procured the whale. These finders would usually be rewarded a modest salvage fee for their cooperation. The whale's oil would be extracted and processed back in Provincetown. The court, siding with Gen, opined that he did effectively own the whale, having done all within his power to claim it. The expectation for him to wait till the whale resurfaced was deemed unreasonable. As the local custom found his actions acceptable, it granted him the right to trover for the wrongfully sold whale. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.